In this video, we're diving into Docker, a game-changing platform in the world of software development and deployment. Docker builds on the concept of virtual machines, offering a more efficient and streamlined way to manage applications. By the end of this video, you'll understand the basics of Docker and how it can streamline your workflow. Let's get started. What is Docker? Docker is a platform and technology that simplifies the development and deployment of applications by packaging them in containerized environments. These containers ensure that apps run consistently across different systems, eliminating compatibility issues. How Docker works? Docker containers act like lightweight, self-sufficient units with their own operating system, CPU processes, memory, and network resources. This isolation allows containers to be easily added, removed, stopped, and started without affecting each other or the host machine. Each container typically runs a specific task, such as a database or a web application, and can be networked together for more complex setups. Docker versus Virtual Machines Unlike virtual machines, Docker containers share the host system's resources directly, making them more efficient. Virtual machines require more resources as they need to emulate hardware and run a full operating system, while Docker containers use the host's operating system and kernel, resulting in better performance and lower overhead. Getting started with Docker To start using Docker, you need to install it on your machine. The main components you will work with are Docker files, Docker images, and Docker containers. Docker file, a simple text document that contains instructions on how to build a Docker image. It starts with a base image and includes commands to install and configure the necessary software. Docker image, built from a Docker file, this is a snapshot of an application and its dependencies. Docker container, a running instance of a Docker image. Basic commands. First. Create a Docker file, define your base image and necessary commands. Second, build an image, use Docker build to create an image from your Docker file. Lastly, run a container, use Docker run to start a container from your image. Using pre-made images. You can also pull pre-configured images from Docker Hub, an online repository of Docker images. This allows you to quickly get started with environments for various programming languages and applications. Docker revolutionizes the way we develop, deploy, and manage applications by providing a consistent, efficient, and isolated environment. Whether you're a developer or a home user, Docker offers a powerful toolset to simplify your workflow and enhance your application's portability and scalability. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more videos.